Alright, so what we're going to do today is I'm going to show you guys how to take a sketch that you've done and turn it into a clean vector illustration using only Photoshop, Illustrator, and a scanner. And this is really easy to do and shouldn't take long at all. So basically what I've already done is I've scanned in my sketch. Uh, the best way to, to sketch and bring it into Photoshop would be on plain white paper. Uh, clean it up with a marker, you know, don't use pencil because the scanner is going to pick up on all those tiny little things, uh, the marks of the pencil, so a clean marker would work best and it just saves you a lot of time when you bring it into Photoshop. So as you can see, I brought in my illustration from the scan and this is the file and you can see the imperfections even with the marker, but those can be pretty easily cleaned up in Photoshop. I just take my brush tool on the black fill it in nice nice and flat you can take the, the eraser clean up anything down here that I want to get rid of say I want that line to be a little nicer all these little pencil marks that the scanner picked up and uh, after taking a little time to do that this is what it should look like already looks a hundred times better um, and then what you want to do is you want to save you know the whole file as full size and then you also want to save as a separate file and save it smaller at about 72 dpi and then I'll just make the, the live trace feature a lot easier in Illustrator and I usually like to name it so um, it's easy to find so I've done that and then open up Illustrator and uh, open the file that I just saved the small file and I'm going to select all and I'm going to hit this little button up here, Live Trace. You can play around with all these presets. Let's see, there's Ink to Drawing. And you'll, you'll notice the change in line weight. Black and white logo. I'm going to choose Comic Art. I think that looks good. And then you're going to click this button, Expand, and that's just going to outline your line so you don't have this background. And it's easier to use the next feature, which is Live Trace. I'm going to select all again, and when I use Live Trace, I usually like to use swatches. You just go down this icon here and your swatches button. You go to color books. Um, Pantones are the best, they have the most variety. Say I want my dog to be this like orange brown color. Do that. Undo that real quick. Let's click on this button here. And this button works really easily because then you're just going to be able to, to fill in just like a coloring book when you were a kid. You can even change the, the strokes. These are colors a little ridiculous, but after playing around with that for a while, this is what I ended up with. Um, I mean, from where we went to where this is, it's already so much better. Let's see a comparison here. Here's the original. And there's the finished product. It's night and day. So hopefully that helps you guys out. It's a real quick, easy way of using Photoshop and Illustrator. And have fun with it. And hopefully I'll have more tutorials coming up soon. Thanks.